That's right. We have a very <laughs> special guest this morning. We're excited to have him on. He is a mind reader. Right. Our first guest says he can read minds, so we invited him here on the show. Uh, welcome right now, mentalist and mind reader Steve Haberman. It wouldn't have changed the number, so you kept the number, didn't you? Am I allowed to tell you this? Oh, I already know. You kept the number. <gasps> you did keep the number, is that right? You did keep, the number. Did yeah, keep the number. You didn't change the number. I tried to figure so now it out. think of what kind of number that you might have. <laughs> it was a high number. You're a powerful guy. It was the number six, wasn't it? It is. Is it the, the number, number six? six. <laughs> Holy smokes. Wow. wow. And that's focus on the word. Wait, does focus mean something to you? Yes. It does. Okay, focus on the word. The word's not focus, but think of the word. It has a round letter in it, yeah. and it's not an O, but it's an A. There's an A in it. Uh -huh. There's also an S in it. Yes. And is the word you're thinking of glasses? It is. It is glasses. Open up to page 184, Heather. Show them. Open it up. <gasps> Do you find page 184? It's gone. And what is this right here? 182. 182. What is that? 185. And David, you've been holding evidence the whole time of this. Open that oh, up. No. Open that oh, up. This is Show good. them oh, inside the evidence bag that you've been holding. There's an envelope. Open up the envelope, okay, David. Okay, Show okay. them. Here we go. Here what we go. is in the envelope? Oh, I know what it is. It's oh, 184. 184. And what is the word at the top of page 184, Heather? Oh, you know what it is, Steve. I know it's glasses. It's glasses. It oh, is glasses. That was, that was super impressive. Smooth. I don't know how you, I held this the Smooth. whole time. Yeah. I can that see why your so show cool. is po so popular. Yeah. Thank you so much well, for joining you. us. That's the signpost up ahead. Your next stop, a mind warp. Time walks now. Please welcome your host, thought reader, Steve Hayden. So is the whole number D0665 3273 A? Is that exactly right? Let's give Michelle a big round of applause. Space, a four in the middle and another seven. Three numbers on this pad match the numbers on that key. Do you guys think that'd be pretty cool? Yeah. I think it'd be a miracle. But let's take a look. The numbers on the back of the key that has been in full view the whole time. Walk up to the microphone there, Nita. Read for them the numbers on the back of the key. Seven four seven. <laughs> seven forty-seven. The same numbers. His name was Midnight. That's pretty, that's pretty detailed. The crazy part was I was very close on this. Yeah, I had a black cat named Midnight too. A black cat named Midnight. Good job, Mark. Thank you very much. Let's tell everybody really loud. What is your favorite color? Cornflower blue. Not just blue. Cornflower blue. What do you like to eat? Fish tacos. Fish tacos. Not just tacos. Fish tacos. That would be impossible if I could get that. It would be impossible. Yeah, but I actually wrote down blue corn flour and fish tacos. <laughs> hey, let's give all my helpers a big round of applause. What's your name, Randy? Randy, now be honest. Are you thinking about beer right now? Are you thinking about beer? Do you know the exact time that Trent was born? Do you remember? We're pretty close to it at least. You do? Okay, tell everybody for the first time what was the time that Trent was born? 4.40 p.m. Let me show you something. I have a clock, and it's set to the time of 4.40. 4.40, this must be for you.